Welcome to vlog five. <laughs> So me and Devin just made some lunch. Um, help me out. Black bean chipotle burgers. Yeah. Okay. Black bean chipotle burgers. They're pretty tasty. Really low carb. I think they were like what 20, 20, 20, yeah. 20 grams of carb in them. So um, we threw a slice of provolone on there, um, and some. I put ketchup on mine. And um, we got these buns, which I think are like 20 grams of carbs too. And this is going to be our main source of carbs for the day because we had we had a really low carb breakfast, um, which was just like eggs. And also, um, we were having a little bit of salad, and um, I had about one and a half servings of ranch on mine. And I'm having some protein, um, one and a half scoops of protein in there. That's what I'm eating for lunch. I'm gonna just got back from the gym probably about 30 minutes ago. I hit legs, Devin hit shoulders, and um, we're gonna go lax it up here in a little bit. And uh, we're gonna go to the movies tonight. I'm gonna be looking for that. All right, and then somewhere in between the video, we're gonna do a quick physique update on how the cut is going. Uh, I got some pictures I'm gonna put in this video. Looking, feeling shredded, I can definitely tell, but uh, I'll talk more about that later when we update you, so, to the next clip. Hey guys, so it's dinner time, just got back from doing cardio at the lacrosse fields, so I'll show you what we've got. I've got three steak, um, one is a, that one's a like a steak burger, um, cheese broccoli, I don't know if you can really see that. The camera's not picking it up so well, but that is Cajun shrimp and some sort of um, vegetable stir fry, as you call it. So high, high protein. Got a low calorie water with mio in it, or no calorie. A um, little bit of fat, not very many carbs. Austin's got pretty much the same thing. I got the same thing. I'm going to have a good bit more carbs than Devin just because I'm eating about. 20 grams more of carbs than he is right now. So I did get some potatoes in there. Um, but tell yeah, tell so me what we're waiting for for dessert. Oh, buddy, we got... Remember the buffins? Well, we put the buffins... Well, we didn't. Devin's mom did. Put the buffins. Actually, I don't think we ever posted the buffin video, do we? We posted the... Cup. No, we did. No, we didn't. We put the cookie video up. Well, we have a buffin video... <laughs> That we'll put up before we put up that one because we're gonna have to make that. But it's when you see when we put the buffin video up, go watch it and it's basically that in cake form. Yeah, it's like it's like one of those like loaves of like dessert bread. Like if you get like it's like banana nut bread. Yeah, it's like banana. Nut. Oh, we'll we'll show you when we get a slice. I'm looking forward to it. Here, my boy Zach. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, awesome, awesome. What are you chowing down on? Dude, we are chowing on some of this delicious banana peanut butter bread, protein bread. So right. good. In a second, we're going to. <laughs> yeah, we're in a second. We're going to give you a um, update on how the shred season is going. After that, we're going to see Ant Man. It's gonna be a good night. Stay tuned. Oh, to be gone. Bang, alright. Just got the haircut. Ready for school in like so many weeks. Uh, sorry, I meant to get some film of us at Ant Man last night. I don't know. One thing that you don't really notice when you watch like YouTube videos is like you kind of lose track of like what you need to be filming. Because, like, we're filming ripped recipes over here and vlogs over here and all this different film. So I kind of just lost lost track of it all and forgot to film at Ant-Man last night. But, uh, overall, it was a great movie. I'd give it a 9 out of 10. Got some mad respect for Ants now. Um, pretty dope character, actually. But, go check that movie out. I'm digging this hair.
it feels so much lighter, like, without, I don't know. Anyways, going to, went this morning to get the oil changed in the Jeep. Now, gonna head to the gym, take, a, take some pictures for Insta, and that's pretty much it for today. Uh, oh, picked up some ingredients at, I went grocery shopping this morning, picked up some ingredients for dinner, so I'm gonna show you what I'm cooking tonight. That's pretty much it. Okay, so before I get started on the salmon for dinner, um, I've started cooking the dessert that I've been making, and I'm not gonna make it a rip recipes because I'm not sure how it's gonna turn out yet, but I'll show you how it's going so far. I'm going for a low carb blueberry pie. So, I've got the crust cooking in the oven right now, and I'm trying to make the blueberry um, filling right now. Uh, I think it's going to turn out pretty good. I'll show you the finished result, and uh, I'll show you the salmon when I get it cooking up. The grill's warming up right now, so it's going to be a good night of eating. Guys, uh, so we've got the salmon cooking up. I picked this uh, chipotle and roasted garlic seasoning up this morning at the grocery store. So I'm going to throw a little bit of this on two of them. And then I also got, um, if you can see that, it's Steakhouse Onion Burger. Camera won't focus, but throw some of that on two of them. Like a lot of seasoning on fish and chicken. Okay, so that's cooking up. The pie is chilling as we speak. I'm really pumped for this one. Let me get away from the fan. All right, so that's cooking up. Gonna eat it with some broccoli. Um, one thing about the seasonings, I really recommend getting um, seasonings that you can see yourself really liking. Like those flavors really sounded good to me. Uh, so you don't, you really don't want to be always eating bland chicken, bland fish, bland steak, uh, because I don't know, it just gets boring so fast, and with seasonings, it's really easy to mix and mash them with garlic powder, onion powder, all that stuff, so make sure you get your seasoning game up, uh, but I'll check with you, I'll check in with you when it's all done, I guess, and I'll show you the dessert, too. I'm gonna be cooking up some of this steamed broccoli to eat with the salmon, show you a little sneak peek of the blueberry pie. <laughs> Low carb, of course, because we're cutting. Be back in a second. This is the finished result of the salmon with some broccoli with, I can't believe it's not butter, and then a half a cup of potato salad, which would be the bulk of my carbs for the day. Um, get the rest of my carbs in with the blueberry pie, which is coming up next. So that is the finished result. I've already had some and it tastes absolutely delicious. I don't know if you can see, but I put it over one cup of, of vanilla Greek yogurt that I mixed some Splenda and cinnamon with. And it's just, it's delicious, guys. Like, I will definitely be doing a Ritz recipes with this. It might be a raspberry version because I'm almost out of blueberries now. But I can't wait to show you guys how to make it. It's great. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll check in with you guys at my PM cardio. Getting my cardio in with my boy Diesel. Uh, that's going to be a wrap for vlog 5.0. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, just know there's big things coming for Iron Predators. So uh, stay tuned. Like the video and subscribe. Peace out.